Hi guys, Yanni ain't here today, he had to step away for an emergency so I'll be shooting T-Way today but he'll be back next week definitely. Who really thought, thanks D, who really thought I wasn't going to be here this week? Hi guys, it's Yanni from Yanomise and welcome back to T-Way episode 68 this week at Yanomise. So, um, I lost a bet. I lost a bet and the bet was I'd have to wear a Tottenham shirt. Now, if Salv had lost, I was going to make Salv wear the Arsenal shirt for the whole of T-Way. Based on the fact that I've lost and I'm a man of my word. Oh my God. And I know people out there that are big Tottenham fans that know I'm such a hardcore gooner are going to be enjoying this. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I can't believe this. Right, so let's start T-Way. Oh, we've got the van. Um, brand new Audi R8, not brand new Audi R8. Audi, Audi R8 tins come for branding. We've already done a Lamborghini uh, for the same customers. This is gonna be branded up. Raised motorbikes there, the smart cars there. This goes here, that came in for a full strip and rewrap. Um, hang on, I'm struggling to shoot T-Way today. We'll go into this section first and obviously we'll save salve till the end. Oh God. X6M is here with full PPF paint protection film. It came in because it had a scratch somewhere, so we had to replace a couple of panels. That is in for security. Was it C200 Estate? Here we've got a Tesla here. Sat in dark grey, cool. It's Andrew job. Hi, Kian. Like, like my shirt. Nice t shirt. <laughs> does it suit me? It does. It does kind of the suit me. The boy said I look wham. You do look wham in it. Do I look you wham do. in this? You do. That's it. Luckily I lost the weight, otherwise I wouldn't fit. Yeah. It's like an extra large. This is small. Usually I wear double XL. You must hate wearing that, bro. Off me on that bag, yeah, and he's asking for a fruit trust. How was your weekend? It was good. It was a good yeah. weekend. Busy. Yeah. D Max 250. Yeah. It was that was good, good, wasn't it? Very good event. Bought yeah. the Lambo back out. Yeah, it's back out finally, so. It was nice. Yeah, good weather as well, so. It, it, was, really it was really good weather, so it was really good weather. All right, anyway. I ain't going to lie, I'm really struggling today. Yeah. I can't concentrate. <laughs> Uh, Lambo Ventador is nearly complete. We're just adding the Nero spoiler, carbon bottom, carbon top, which completes it. You need the spoiler on an Aventador. If he does have the big spoiler, to me, an Aventador looks really, really weird. Um, if you've got an Aventador or a Huracan and you want a full kit, Nero design. Uh, details are on the screen. G Wagon here, this was for a full D chrome. I know he wants a wrap as well. I'm not sure how we're going to try and squeeze it in. I wasn't in yesterday, I was in Manchester. He rang Andrew and said, Andrew, do you reckon you squeeze in? He's like, we can't. He goes, speak to Jan, speak to Jan. So we're going to see what we're going to do. Andy, come in. Come in, Roger. So um, come in. Jan, welcome to the dark side. I've been expecting you. How are you? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Suits you. Makes you look slimmer. I am slimmer. Yeah, but it makes you look even more slimmer. Guys, doesn't that suit you? Look, man of his words. I'm a man of my You're word. A man of your word. I'm, a, I'm, yeah. I'm a betting man. I'm a gambling man. Listen, you see the tattoos I have <laughs> and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm a gambling man. I'm a betting man. Yeah. And if I lose, I lose. I'll pay the bet. I've got to be honest. I honestly didn't expect that to happen. But anyway. Yeah, they, they let me yeah. down, the team. They let me down. Um, oh, then I wouldn't say they let you down. Well, they did somewhere in Tottenham. Yeah, just, they should have got it. Was just luck. It was luck as well from our side. Anyway, how are you? Not great, not great. I'm not going to lie. I'm not feeling this. Anyway, let's talk to, yeah. let's talk to Pav. <laughs> Pav's in. Pav was off yesterday. He's got a problem with his ear. He's got blue ear. Or, or he's speaking to people upstairs. Right. Basically, I was cleaning my ear with a cotton wool bud. Um, I left it in there and as I was brushing my teeth, I hit it and it, yeah, it burst my eardrum. So my eardrums popped, but thankfully I'm not going to be deaf. Huh? Yeah, exactly. Jesus, that's not good. Whose is this then? His? No, I had to go and buy it. I, do you know you I don't even know why to buy well. it because he only had a large and we could only find an extra large and even an extra large is a bit tight on me. Well, did you actually buy that? Well, they bought it. Well, Yana might have bought it. Anyway, I hope your ear gets better, Pav. So do I. Okay, that's it. Dion's in. There's no Rio today. Yeah, no Rio's Rio. Rio's sick. Yeah. So we're sending my love. Um, get well better, twin. Yeah, get better. I need you. Do some work. I need you, you, you. You're going to end up. Oh. I'm not an end dubs fan, I'm not gonna lie. No offense. No, no, no! But that's not me. I like a waste man, that's not me. I'm more of that type of fan. Fix it, yeah. yo, now that's not me. Yeah, no, that's not that's me. Not me. <laughs> that's definitely not me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Rio get, uh, get better, bro. 
Uh, let's head over there. You know Nico Mike's going to laugh their heads off. Let's, let's go to the back. Um, distinctive detailing are here. They're cleaning my car and the Yanomai's car cleaning product is now out in Halfords in every single store. Um, Dino is here. Hi Dino. Hi mate. Let me see. He's getting ready. He's got the product. Look at the look, 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 look. They're really, It's good actually. I might be back here later with my shirt. Um, How you doing? Oh wow. Don't. Don't. Not a good day, eh? It's really not a good day. Not for an Arsenal supporter. Yeah. Start to say. Jez's event store is there. I used this the other week for a music video. I can't really say for who, but it'll come out soon and you'll understand in June. And yeah, it's incredible. Incredible who the person is. Yeah, but I can't tell you anymore. Andrew's M3 is there. The V class is there. I've got two people coming to see it today. So hopefully that'll be sold and be gone by next week. Let's go see Nico Mark and then see that, that fella south. So what car do I drive now and what am I considering buying in the future? Well, I drive a Lamborghini Urus right now and I've got the new Urus on order and I've got the new replacement Aventador on order. So I'm excited for that. We're currently driving a Mark 1 TT, but next car, I've been living with Kian and uh, it's definitely made me want to get a BMW just so I can get that rear wheel drive. So I currently drive an Audi A3, 2 litre TFSI, 250-ish brake. Next car, Jap car maybe, like Jap cars. So what cars I'm currently driving is Fiat 500 wrapped in satin black, an Audi R8 Gen 2 wrapped in chrome blue. Currently I'm driving a Honda Civic. I saw the GTR, I don't know what I'm gonna get in the future, but let's see. If someone wants to buy the R8, I might let it go as well. You never know. Currently driving or just bought a VW Scirocco TSI. Had that for about a month now. Okay, so I'm currently driving a Lamborghini Huracan Performante and an M4 competition, but I want to do a build, so I would like to either do some sort of 1.8 turbo build or a drift car build. So that's definitely my next upcoming project, which I want to do. Currently, I drive a 2010 Seat IB4. And in the future, just like key, I want to build something. I've always been like a VW fan, VW, Audi. So anything along them lines, I'm happy. The way we organize the parts is we've got separate racks for each car. So obviously the rack is labeled up for what car it is. Really, we do get mixed up sometimes if we strip a car in one unit and then it goes over to another unit. Generally, we work it out because we should take everything off, label it up. Just to give you an example, panels out the back on this one. Screws are all labelled up and bagged up, so we know what screws are there. Until that bag is empty, I'm not happy when I'm putting it back together. Have I ever thought about franchising the business? Yes, quite a few times. The issue is when you franchise the business, you lose control. If people mess up the jobs, it's your name that gets tarnished, even though you're not doing it yourselves, because theoretically it's an external company. So yes, I have thought about it, but right now, I don't think that's the way for me to go. So as we head into here, um, actually, I'll tell you a funny story. Andy was just over there, but he's back over here. Andy, what happened, what happened to Pav's, um, Pav's ear? How, how did that happen to him? What's the story that you keep telling that? Pav's like, stop saying that, Andy. Well, we all know Pav's like got a thing about dozing off. So I reckon he was actually cleaning his ear and he was dozing off and he was just like. <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> Brutal. He's, he's going to kill me when he sees this tonight. <laughs> Brutal. C63 is in a full wrap, um, shuts and returns. It is going, it's going midnight, midnight green. Uh, I think it's got a bit of a flip to it as well. So yeah, the G-Wagon is now complete. It just needs to be fitted back up. Um, and then look at them, look at them. Anyway, we'll talk to them in a minute, maybe. Um, yeah, G-Wagon's fully done, just needs the arches back on, fully, fully fitted up. The customer came to see us to drop some bits off and he's very, very happy. So shout out to you. We've got an F8 Tributo. Um, this is the first of two that are coming in, both having black roofs. We don't usually do roofs. However, there was two Ferraris. I'm gonna do a black roof for this, because it is a Ferrari. Um, and I think Ferrari charged about 10 grand to do a gloss black roof. We only charge nine and a half grand. <laughs> joke. Um, but yeah, it's F8 Tributo, gloss black roof, totally changes the look of the car. So it's quite nice. Let's see. Hello, boys. Oh, look, we're all in white. We're all in white. We're all in white. Does one of you hold the mic? We're all in white. Hello, Harry Kane. <laughs> Harry Kane. Oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'd rather be Sun. Yeah, I'm a top goal scorer. It's such a good I'm feeling you. So usually, see, the red and white is what is my colour. So the red and white, but 
It is red and white and blue. Mm. Luck, luck mm. lost some weight, otherwise this wouldn't have fit in. <laughs> so I've still, I've still got to get there. But you know what? I've dropped from 20 stone free to 17 stone 13 or so. And you can show that on the screen, whatever. Um, if you want to see my journey, you can go over to the Annie YouTube channel. Who else? What's news? What's the gossip? What's the deal? Is this the colour of the C63s going? Yeah. This is going midnight, midnight green. So... Yeah, I think this one's going to look good. Yeah. If it's going to look good. Yeah. What else happening? What's the news? What's the gossip? I think AFTV is not going to be happy with you. Yeah. Oh, don't talk about the shirt. <laughs> talk, I've got to go into the back and speak to Sal, but now I'm talking about other stuff. Talk about anything but football to me. You know what I mean? Yeah. Anyway, let's head back into say Sal. Finally come up. Do you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking I'm going to put my jumper back on. To think, sad, or should I just go in there with my Tottenham shirt on and just see, and just see his face? Okay, so what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to go in there and have the camera on him when I walk in. So, because you've got to get his facial expression. Yeah, yeah. yeah, cool. Well, then. I'm not sure if he's in there, but there is something there you might want to see. Meet me upstairs, enjoy some cake on the way. That's a Tottenham cake. That's a Tottenham, I don't know if you know about the Greg's, that's a Tottenham cake. It feels very old. When did he buy that? Meet me upstairs, I'm not having no cake on the way. But... Oh, these lot have set somewhere up, ain't they? Oh, you lot, you mother What, am I going up first? I think it's upstairs, upstairs. What, upstairs, yeah, upstairs? Yeah, yeah. Not here? No, no, no. Oh, this guy. <laughs> this guy, this guy's like that, yeah? This guy's like that, yeah? These lot have proper plans like for <laughs> me. Yes, Harry. Yeah, not sure we can uh, wrap your car in Spurs blue with the Indian white wheels. That's not a problem at all. And yet, for sure, your car will be ready for Champions League on Wednesday. Oh, hi, Ian. Sorry, Harry. I'll come back to you on that one. Morning, Yanni. Morning, sir. Looking good. How are you? Very well, thanks. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> he's all laughing, he's all wet. On top of the world. On top, top of, the, of world. the world, yeah. Good weekend? Really good weekend. Let's really good it. weekend. One second. Here's the football section. So, um, if you've been paying attention to the football section, Sal is a hardcore Tottenham fan, I'm a hardcore Arsenal fan, and we had a bet. The bet was, whichever team finishes higher, the other person needs to wear that person's shirt. So if Arsenal finished higher, he would have had to wear an Arsenal shirt. If Tottenham finished higher, I would have to wear a Tottenham shirt. And as you can see, I'm wearing a Tottenham shirt, which is um, brutal to be an Arsenal fan and doing this, but it's a bet, a bet's a bet. I'm a man of my word. Respect you for that, Yanni. Gracious in, um, in defeat. Oh, yeah. All due respect. Yeah, it's not great though. Um, so, how do you feel? <laughs> There's nothing better than this. This is like probably the pinnacle after getting married, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, wife. <laughs> Sam, this is your time, mate. I ain't gonna lie, if it was the other way around and you were wearing an Arsenal shirt, you'd be getting buried. Um, you got nothing to say? Glory, glory, Tottenham Hotspur. Glory, glory, Tottenham Hotspur. Glory, glory, Tottenham Hotspur. And the Spurs go marching in. Nice. Look at Gina. Look at Gina. Look at Gina. Turn around. Did it suit me? Right. Um, let us know in the comment section, are you an Arsenal fan or a Tottenham fan? Or do you support another team? Also, if you'd lost the bet, would you have done this? Wearing a Tottenham shirt, being a hardcore Arsenal fan is like the, is like sacrilege, like the worst thing you could possibly do. You've seen people move across. If you saw William Gallas go from Arsenal to Tottenham, you saw the biggest one, Sol Campbell go from Tottenham to Arsenal. Oh, Adebayor? Did he? Oh, we Adebayor, did, yeah, mate. yeah, no, Adebayor, wow, yeah, so a few people have done it. Because I'm not, I'm not getting paid hundreds of thousands of pounds to wear this shirt. Unless you guys make this video like 10 million and then it'll be worth it. Anyway, Sal, um... Oh. Would you like a um, signature on the shirt? Tell you what I'm going to do with this shirt. Um, I think I'm going to go downstairs and clean my car with it. <laughs> 
got the animal products out today. So I think I think we'll head downstairs and we'll use this shirt to clean my car. Yeah, I think that's a good shout. <laughs> you wearing your shirt today, yeah? <laughs> he said no, no Yanomai uniform for him today. I ain't gonna lie, this is a very tough tea way. This is a very tough tea. That Tottenham cake, when did you buy that Tottenham cake? Yesterday. Yeah, I knew I, I said that, it didn't feel fresh. <laughs> didn't feel fresh. It felt very old and hard and stale, like how I'm feeling right now. Alright, so well listen. Well done, come out, give me a hug. So that is the end of Football Talk with myself and Salvatore. We'll be back next season where I'm sure we'll put another bet on where I need to get revenge. But um, Salv, fair play, mate. Nice one. You were the winner. Yanny. Well done, you were the winner. Due respect. <sighs> me and Salvatore, he'll, he'll, he'll love this picture. This picture will be getting used everywhere. Him and his Tottenham, mate, Jan. Thanks to all the um, supporters as well, sending me messages. Oh, it's been absolutely mental. Yeah. Jamie. Jamie, who's Jamie? He knows, he's my golf friend. Okay. I'm gonna give you a F U to Nick. <laughs> Nick. F U Nick. Thanks for the ammo. F U Nick. He'll be he'll be screenshotting this and putting it everywhere just so you know. I will become a meme. Yan and in a Tottenham shirt. <laughs> Got it. So what well I mate. Sweet Yan. Nice I'll on. take this off you. Um I think we'll head back downstairs. I'm gonna use this to clean my car right now. So that is the end of the T-Way. Um, I've done my bit. I'm never putting one of these on again. So at the end of this shirt. And we'll use it to clean my car. That is what the shirt's good for. That is what the shirt's good for. Nice, nice. Guys, thank you for watching the T-Way. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and I'll see you next week. Oh, does anyone else want this? You know what? I might put it out there. If you want this, let me know. Okay, I'll tip in the comment section. If you want an extra large Tottenham shirt worn by Yanni the Gooner. Clean now. Anyway, I've got work to do.